Here's five things that would have made my life so much easier when I started Plotter Web Development. Number one, you have to plan your idea before starting. I'm not saying just think about the start, middle and end of your project. I'm saying come up with a solid idea for how you want your app or your web app to be at each stage of development. That way you've always got something to work towards. Number two, get feedback as soon as possible. Flutter makes it really easy to make quick mock-ups of systems so that you can start getting feedback right away. Number three, use one state management system and stick to it. Some people might argue that it's better to have multiple and that can work, but for the most part, there's more value in just having one and sticking to it. It's easier to maintain. It's easier to remember going forward if you don't touch the project for like half a year. Number four, use what's already out there. There's a huge amount of packages which are already out there on PubDev, which probably will provide an adequate solution for the thing that you're looking for. Unless a feature is a pivotal part of your app and part of the unique selling point, then it's probably better just to get some code that's already been made as long as it's fit for purpose. Number five, test your app on different internet browsers and different devices. Flutter's performance tools are all right, but you won't get better feedback from actually trying it on physical devices and a mixture of browsers. They all behave in their own unique ways. And of course you want an app that is gonna work on all sorts of, of devices.